Quand il me prend dans ses bras, il me parle tout bas, je vois le en rose. Il me dit de mon amour, de mon de tous les jours, et ça me fait quelque chose. This is always the hardest part. I never know what to wear. This is like the first get ready with me for the first day of school where I'm not doing a full face of makeup. I feel like this is growth. I'm being so honest and I didn't ask for my opinion, but like you don't need a full face of makeup. Okay, so I'm getting ready to go good morning from 5037 today's the first day of school but it looks different than all my other first days of schools because i am living on a ship now with <laughs> i did steal her hat for today but um yeah i'm just gonna take you guys along with me on my day my camera is blinking at me so i need to go charge my battery we're in a rush this morning laptop check notebook check pencil pouch Our room is on the fifth deck, but Lido deck, which is where we're going to be eating this morning, is on the ninth. So that means we're climbing four flights of stairs. So we're meeting a couple of our friends for breakfast, but I have a feeling we're going to be the first ones here. You think? I think so. are you on a scale of 1 to 10 for school? For school per se, I'm at 10. 10? Good! Okay, Peter? I'm at a 9. nine. You're at a 9? Why a 9? You know, global I'm excited for, but the film one, I don't know. Yeah. This is too on a scale of 1 to 10, I'd say I'm a good 9. A 9? Nine. Nine. Yeah, 9. First class is Global Studies. We got to Global Studies a little early, but basically this is a mandatory class that everybody has to take. It's on both A days and B days, and this room gets really, really crowded. Wait, I took too much. Aquifer save. Air mask that sits over the Atlantic. Do we have any there we go. Okay, we just got back from Global Studies. That was honestly a really entertaining class. What do you think about it? I liked it. There were three different people teaching and they all specialized in like different things. So one of them is a geologist. Update, we're not going to Morocco anymore because there was a huge earthquake and a bunch of people were affected by it. And so thankfully, Semester C made the right call and decided to cancel that. And so we're going to one of the diversion ports. And so our diversion port is in Spain. We have a little mailbox outside of our door and there was a four minute. This is our cabin agreement So we're gonna fill this out right now. I just took my ID picture So slay with the IMAX camera like circa 2003 This is like so yeah, it, like it was taken on like a, a DS <laughs> Like a calculator or a Blackberry. No a Blackberry. <laughs> That's what it looks like. So Kate was smart and brought some Trader Joe's cinnamon school book cookies. <laughs> yeah, I didn't have any room in my luggage for these. But when we were at the hotel in Antwerp, I stole a bunch of Nutella packets because I knew that they weren't gonna have Nutella on this ship. So we're gonna dip it. Oh, is it good? Is it good? God, <laughs> I'm so excited. Mm-hmm. Like. It doesn't get much better than that. What were your honest thoughts of global studies? I liked it. It honestly didn't even feel that long. 
Yeah, and I feel like it went by really quick. It also wasn't what I was expecting. Because I wasn't yeah, me either. Yeah. But it was really educational. So we learned a lot about Morocco's culture. I've always seen a lot of people wear the evil eye charm, and I never knew what it was. I always thought it was pretty, and now I know. I feel like I learned a lot today. I've got two more classes today, marketing and health and wellness, but that's not until 15.30, which is three o'clock. And then I have another class later. 24 hour time on this ship, which has been an adjustment because my brain did not pick that up very fast. Okay, we'll see y'all later. We're gymming. We're getting up. We're gymming. Anytime I would go get crumble, I was like, do you guys want to crumble today? <laughs> this is the fit. We got the Lululemon BBL jackets on. <laughs> I haven't actually seen the gym yet, so this is going to be my first time seeing it. And it'll be y'all's first time too. gym and I'm all sweaty and gross no Kate just left this on my bed her laptop has water all over it no I need to take a shower really really bad my next class isn't until I should probably have this memorized but 1540 to 1700 and that is my marketing class I'm actually really looking forward to this class because for those of y'all who don't know my major is entrepreneurship with a minor in marketing growing up and doing social media since 14 I've had to learn how to market myself with brand deals and just making a name for myself this is gonna be really interesting I'm fresh out of the shower. I feel a million times better. I wanted to give you guys an update what life has been like on the ship and kind of what we've been up to because this is my first day of school so we've only been on the ship for a very short amount of time. Today's Monday and on Saturday is when we embarked on the World Odyssey which is the name of this ship. All of Saturday it was embarkation day. We had a lot of free time to mingle, get to know people. Yeah we had back-to-back -back meetings, orientations, different sessions. We got put into a sea so there's there's like the Baltic Sea, Caspian Sea, Red Sea, Yellow Sea. Kate and I are part of the Red Sea, which is the best sea. And it's crazy because all of our friends also ended up in that sea. So it just worked out. First things first, thoughts on the gym. There is 600 students and there's only four treadmills. But the good thing is because we all have different schedules, there weren't as many people in. There's an indoor gym, like a tiny outdoor gym. Working out in general on the treadmill and on the deck was so weird because you can feel the ship moving as you're walking. So you kind of start walking like diagonally. And then when I was doing some core exercises on the deck i just felt my back like my spine just moved back and forth i've actually been really impressed with the food on this ship obviously i watched a bunch of videos beforehand on tiktok and youtube of people talking about the dining hall whether berlin or lido is better the food is the same on both of them the only difference is lido just has a much better view it's less cruise ship style kind of more outdoor indoor buffet if that makes any sense we took a consensus and all eight of us like lido better but the food is pretty good for what it could be every student gets about seven minutes of wi-fi internet per day and it goes by so fast but they have a thing called intranet the ship's wi-fi and they have some websites specifically picked so that we can access at any time and then some other informative sites that we might need in case of researching for classes ship time is so weird in comparison to regular time on land things feel a lot slower like your day feels longer because one there's only so far you can go but then also you're getting used to a new college schedule there's no doubt i definitely miss home i miss all my friends in idaho and i miss my parents in texas i'm gonna do some journaling this is my journal that has been with me since my junior year of high school that kind of shows how bad i was at journaling for a little bit i would just forget to write things down and life got so busy i made a big dent in it this summer because i journaled a lot and prioritized that two of my relationships start to finish have been in here the rest of this i'm hoping to fill up by the end of semester at sea so i'm gonna do a journal entry today 
All right, for lunch today, we've got a mixture of things. I've got this vegan sandwich, a salad, stuffed bell pepper, and then a fish filet. I don't know what that noise is. Someone's scraping something. It's a whale. <laughs> How excited are you? I'm like five out of ten excited. I'm a bit sleepy. <laughs> I slept in and my alarm was uh, in the wrong time zone, but yeah, we whatever. didn't see you at breakfast this morning, <laughs> but it's okay. We've got our coffee and cake. Kate is back at the room because she spilled her whole water bottle on her laptop and she had a crisis, so we're posted up on Lido right now. <laughs> Me being the horrible vlogger that I am. Um, forgot to film that I went to marketing, but it was so funny because the class started at 1540 and We were all in here and Robin is just sleeping right here and Kate curled my hair for me and at 1539 I look at the clock and I'm like, oh my god guys, we gotta go So I was in fact late to my class and I felt horrible that I walked in late But not that this is an excuse, but like six other people did as well Robin also had a class as well. So yeah, that was kind of funny I'm looking at my schedule right now and next class I have is individual and family development I don't know why I kept thinking health and wellness was today, but that's actually tomorrow That's at 1710 in the Union starboard forward. No idea where that is So I'm gonna go ask somebody right now So we're getting used to the fact that we're on the ocean and that this is my beautiful view every single day Um, I think I'm gonna do some studying maybe start taking some notes and read chapter one for our marketing class because we have a lot of stuff that we have to do and then i'm gonna go to class and i will try to film hey, Not here right now. I think I got food poisoning. <laughs> and we're trying to book our stuff for Malaga. You did? We're finding Airbnbs, flights. From the center of town. The thing is, if we get closer to town, yeah. it goes up to like a thousand dollars. That is more than eight people, then we can like get someone else as well. That one is beautiful. I, I see what you're saying. You know what I'm saying? Oh my gosh, this little sun. Uh, it's giving luxurious, it's giving Mallorca, it's giving sexy, it's giving fun. <sighs> We were all hanging out in our room. Even though our rooms are pretty much like all the same size, I think the layout just makes it so much better here and everybody decided to come in and hang out. They do snack every night at 10 p.m. which is always fun because we're pretty hungry then. And I did my skincare so I look very like slugged right now. Tomorrow we've got an early day because we're gonna go to the library and book our stuff at the computers because we do not have good wi-fi at all on this ship but yeah that is it for today's video if you guys liked it make sure to give it a thumbs up and if you didn't don't do anything i love y'all so much have a great rest of your day and i will see you in my next video ciao